Our Florida. Would you give him a nice hand? A hell of a country boy. Just a Bobby Hyde. I thank you so, so very much. I've uh, been thinking about this for a long time. I've seen so many friends that I haven't seen for so long. I got a little bit of a bad voice tonight, but we came out of 85 degree weather, and I can't remember how cold it was up here. It's as, uh, but for you folks to come out to, and uh, been drive through this kind of weather to be here, I certainly appreciate it. It's, it's a big thrill to have Jerry Francis back on base and Chuck Johnson. <clears throat> Who's the other guy? Donnie Ward. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to thank Gary for backing us up on the drums. As I say, my voice is a little bit bad tonight, and it's getting wor get worse, but if you folks me, have a few drinks, uh, it'll get better. <laughs> PMG, fellas. Stay all night, stay a little longer, dance all night and dance a little longer. The lock the cup and throw it in the corner, don't see why it don't stay a little longer. Stay all night, stay a little longer, dance all night and dance a little longer. The lock the cup and throw it in the corner, don't see why it don't stay a little longer. Everybody knows my blue-eyed Sally, she lives down by Shimbone Alley. Number on the gate and number on the door, round that corner by the grocery store. Stay all night, stay a little longer, dance all night and dance a little longer. Pull up the coat and throw it in the corner, don't see why it won't stay a little longer. Charlie Johnson! Washed out the bottom of the hill. Be creek up, little creek level. Plow my field with the devil's shovel. See all night, stay a little longer. Dance all night and dance a little longer. Pull off the curtain, throw it in the corner. Don't see why it don't stay a little longer. One more, Charlie. Sick and laid on the bean, headed for the barn to eat a little corn. I'm gonna party till early morning. Stay all night, stay a little longer, dance all night and dance a little longer. Pull off the coat and throw it in the corner, don't see why it'll stay a little longer. a little bit loud because it keeps hollering back at me here. Oh, Troy's yeah. getting a little closer here because they're going to be their ship. They're uh, broadcasting this all the way down to Stoughton. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, where else? Yeah, yeah. Hurley, was it Hurley? <laughs> Went into Hurley tonight. <clears throat> These guitars are sort of like a woman, you gotta fool with them a little while before they work right. <laughs> Here's a Gene Watson tune. When the last breath of life is gone from my body and my lips are cold. As a sea, when my friends gather round at my farewell party, won't you just pretend you love me? Be 
So many familiar faces that I haven't seen in 11 years. I've been gone, well, April 1st, the first this month, 1972. That's 11 years ago, and it's our first trip back. We own a nightclub down in Oldsmar, Florida. It's just west of Tampa, toward Clearwater. And it's called the Maverick Lounge. A lot of you folks have been down there. <laughs> sure have. <clears throat> and, uh... We also, I told you, I told you to stay in the truck, cowgirl. <laughs> we, uh, we, we train uh, racehorses now. My wife, Mary, uh, trains them and, and races them. Next week, we'll, we'll go to uh, Calder Race Course in Miami, Florida. And she'll stay there all summer until the middle of October before she comes back to Tampa. I'll have to stay over in Tampa by myself. <laughs> well, Mary will have to be down there by herself. I'll sneak down there and check her out now and again, make sure everything's going all right. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> well, really, the only thing I look at is the racing form anymore. I'm 50 years old, you know. So, uh, everybody stand by. Let's take time out for this message. Let's give the band a drink here, Bob, if you could get one of those young ladies up here. Because, like Chuck here said, the world don't look right when you're sober anyhow. <laughs> Chuck was down, uh, it was a few years ago, and uh, he was trying to cross a, a street there, was standing on a street corner, and uh, there was a blind man there trying to cross the street corner, and he had, a, had his C&I dog beside of him, and uh, all of a sudden the C&I dog just cocked up his leg and started to wet down his shoe and his pants leg, and then when he got through, the blind man reached into his pocket to get a dog biscuit. And he was reaching it down there. And a, an old lady seen this and she came over and she said, you gotta be the most kindest person I've ever seen. 
<clears throat> the blind man said, why? She said, after what that dog done to your pants leg and your shoe, you're going to reward him with a dog biscuit? He said, lady, I ain't rewarding him. I'm just trying to find out where his head's at. I'm going to kick him in the ass. <laughs> same street corner the next day they were waiting to cross and uh, everybody was standing there and there was a dog sitting down beside beside this uh, one guy and the guy looked down and said does your dog bite and the guy said no he don't bite and he started to reach under and pet him and the dog just raked him from his elbow to his wrist he just scraped him good bit him the guy jumped back and he said I thought you said your dog wouldn't bite he said, my dog don't bite. He said, mine's at home, but I don't know where this damn thing came from. <laughs> Let's see here. Let's do a, a tune that Carl Pro Butler wrote. Uh, Ricky Skaggs made such a big hit on. Off somewhere the music's playing. Holds the line that I love so I was blind, I could not see That she meant the world to me But like a fool I stood and watched her go Thank you. 